We're back to The War of Art again by Stephen Pressfield. Absolutely amazing book. Tons of wisdom. I highly recommend that you pick it up. In this micro chapter called The Professionalist Patient, we're going to talk about patience when you have a super creative, wonderful idea. I mean, how often do we have super creative, wonderful ideas and we're extremely ex inspired about it? And then without thinking, we plunge headlong into the practice. I mean, it's a level of intensity that can't be sustained in that idea when we plunge headfirst into it. Yeah, you can work furiously for hours straight and maybe keep it up for a, a week or so, but soon you'll, you're going to hit a wall and crash. Stephen Pressfield tells us that the professional understands delayed gratification. Here's what he says, quote, The professional arms himself with patience, not only to give the stars time to align in his career, but to keep himself from flaming out in each individual work. He knows that any job, whether it's a novel or a kitchen remodel, takes twice as long as he thinks and costs twice as much. He accepts that. He recognizes reality. End quote. Any creative endeavor we have takes time. And it's really healthy to start it with a little bit of practicality. Now, I'm not saying that you don't start as soon as possible. I mean, when you're hit with the inspiration, begin right away. But the operative word here is begin. But don't burn yourself out by grinding constantly for days. One tool you can use for this is by Grab Gabrielle Oltengen. It's called Whoop, W-O-O-P. She's a world-renowned researcher that has spent her life studying how dreams are turned into reality. She says it's important to dream big, but that's not enough. We need to rub it up against reality. I love that, rub it up against reality. So here's the Whoop practice, W-O-O-P. W is for wish. O is for outcome or the benefits of completing your wish, like a Y. The other O is for obstacles. And the last P is for plan, W-O-O-P. So, got an awesome creative idea? Wonderful. What is your wish for this creative goal? That's your W. What is the outcome you will experience it once you accomplished it? That's the O. Now, what obstacles may get in the way for you to complete this awesome thing. Maybe burnout because you're so excited you're going, going too hard at the beginning, possibly. And the last part of WHOOP is plans. So what is your plans to overcome those obstacles and guarantee your success? Operative word here, plans, plural, have multiple plans. So that's WHOOP, W-O-O-P, Gabrielle Oltengen. It only takes a minute to run through this. Actually, I do it every single day. I show up every day doing my creative habit. And then one of the first things I do is set a goal for the day, you know, my wish. Then I set, what is the outcome? How, you know, how wonderful would it be if I complete this? And then I rub it up against the reality by looking at the obstacles and then creating a plan for the day so I can burn through any obstacles and get my creative habit churning through every single day. So, do you have inspiration right now? Awesome. Be a little bit patient. Rub it up against reality and then get started.